Hey everyone, my name is Riley and this video is a comparison between HubSpot and Monday.com. Now, the reason that I am making this video is because Monday.com recently started advertising themselves as a CRM. So I'm assuming if you are watching this video, you're kind of stuck into mind which is going to be the best CRM between HubSpot and Monday. Now, HubSpot is actually a CRM. That's what HubSpot is and was built for. Whereas Monday.com is more of a project management tool that has been able to put together features that somewhat resemble a CRM. However, with that being said, you actually might not need a CRM. You might be okay going with Monday.com. And this video is going to be explaining exactly that the features, the differences, what Monday does do as a CRM and what it doesn't do as a CRM. Now, the first thing that I want to talk about here is of course going to be the pricing. Now, Monday.com is far and away cheaper and this is exactly what I was talking about when I said you might not actually need a CRM, you might just need the CRM functions that Monday.com offer. So with Monday, we essentially have three plans right here. We have the basic, which is eight pounds, something like $10 per month, standard, which is probably 13 to $14 per month, and then the pro, which is around $20 per month. Now, even though HubSpot is more expensive, the free tools or the free plan on HubSpot is absolutely fantastic. I have tested out many different CRMs. I have made tutorials on a lot of different CRMs on this channel, and out of all of the free plans, HubSpot is definitely the best in what it gives you access to. If you do want to try this out and you do want to get access, you can do so using the top link in the description. So I would recommend if you do decide to go with HubSpot, just go for the free plan first of all, and then when you need to upgrade, then go to the starter. I wouldn't really recommend going to the starter from the get-go, unless you see a specific tool right here that you actually need. But essentially with the HubSpot pricing, this startup is going to be for individual entrepreneurs slash small businesses, the same with this professional. And then we also have some more enterprise plans that are a lot more expensive. So jumping into how these tools are similar, how these tools are different, effectively with the basic functions of a CRM, Monday.com can absolutely keep up. For example, in the contact area, which is one of the main basic features of a CRM, is being organized and having all of your contacts in one place, being able to access them at any time. So this is HubSpot right here. These are currently the contacts that I have. And then with the Monday.com CRM, we can go over to contacts right here. And right here, we can see pretty much all of the same information. We can see the contact name, the phone number, the email, and the deal value. Over here, we have the name, the email, the phone number, and then the budget slash deal value. You can also edit the columns on both to add in new information that you want to see at a glance. But basically for the contact section, they are both as good as each other. If anything, Monday might be slightly better. Just the layout of it, the way it looks is slightly better than HubSpot. The deals area as well, another super important part of a CRM, being able to see all of the current deals in the pipeline laid out like this and being able to move these along into the different sections. So for example, let's just call this marketing services. We of course want to be able to come along here and as the deal progresses, move it into these different life cycle stages so that we can see exactly where the deal is. Now, Monday.com does a fantastic job of keeping up with HubSpot in this area. That is Monday.com right here. And then with HubSpot, we can go over to sales, deals, and then we have a very similar layout right here where we can move this around into these different areas. Now, with Monday and HubSpot, we can also like set goals and do these certain things. So if we go to the forecast area right here, we can see a forecast and data on the current pipeline. So how many of these deals were closed? What's the goal? What is the pipeline looking like? And then once again, we can do this over on Monday. And honestly, I would say the layout on monday.com is a lot nicer. Like the user interface is beautiful on this. So if you only need these basic CRM functions, I would honestly recommend going with monday.com. However, what monday.com won't allow you to do is certain things that make a CRM a real CRM. So this is things like going into the contacts area right here, clicking into a contact, and then being able to call them straight from the software. 
So I could literally click into call right here. I would of course have to set it up. This is just a brand new test account. But then we can also create an email inside of HubSpot. All we would have to do is connect the inbox. And then from here, we can literally email and call clients directly from the CRM. Of course, you cannot do this on Monday as all we have is access to the data, the contacts, the deals, and the basic CRM functions. With HubSpot, we can also go into the inbox right here and you can actually have all of your emails inside of HubSpot so that you can read your entire email inbox. You can reply to emails all from inside of HubSpot rather than using a different email tool. HubSpot also allows us to send out email marketing. So rather than just emailing actual contacts, if you are going into marketing, you can email your email list and set up email automations from inside of HubSpot. Once again, this is not a thing that is available on Monday. You can also create landing pages and websites inside of HubSpot. You can track your ad campaigns and have all of the information inside of here. We can create coaching playlists. So with the sales calls that your team are having on HubSpot, you can actually create playlists and then send it to like new hires, for example, or even train your sales team with the best calls that you can put into playlists. We can also go, go down to playbooks. You can create call scripts for your team to read whilst they are on calls. And we can add questions down here where they can fill this in with notes. So monday.com does have some of the basic CRM features. And this is exactly what I was talking about at the start of the video. When I said you might not actually need a CRM and instead you might just need a platform to track data that somewhat resembles a CRM. And this is exactly what monday.com is. Once again, if you do want to sign up and get the free trial access to both HubSpot and Monday, you can do so using the links down in the description. Either way, if you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.